So this is the main event here tonight at the Newport Centre. We're in the corner of Spencer Alton. 38 fights. Made his debut in June 60, uh, 88. He's got some names on his re record. Another Welshman, Wayne Ellis, Steve West, Graham Burton, Ian Strudwick, Frank Eubanks, Neville Brown, Colin Pitters, Antoine Tava, Andy Flute, Paul Murray, Chris Mulcahy. He's had 38 fights. He's also found a bit of time to spend in the Foreign Legion. And of course we're going to the corner of the three-time ABA champion, Joe Kautzaghi. He's had two fights, two stoppages. Made his debut against Paul Hanlon, that was on the undercard of Lennox Lewis, Frank Bruno down in Cardiff. And only last month on the undercard of Billy Schwer and Paul Burke. Stop Stinger Mason. <coughs> Managed by Mickey Duff and Terry Lawless. Very unusual for a man who's only had two fights to top the bill, but I've obviously got high hopes for Joe Kautzaghi. Just getting on the gloves now. Whether he'll have a quick knockout tonight, we'll have to wait and see. But he's won three ABA titles, all at different weights. Bit of a gesture there, which I thought wasn't right. Perhaps I was mistaken. Maybe it's the way I'm looking through the camera. So, this is the second time that I've seen Joe Calzaghi box. I've seen Spencer Alton box many times. Very cagey man. As I say, spent some time in the Foreign Legion. Got away from Derby for a while. But Joe Caltaki can bang. So we best not blink. This match at super middle. Kautzaghi, southpaw. Had some nice little shots of the body. Getting a little bit flash, doesn't need to do that. He's in the learning stages at the moment. But Spencer Alton has been known to poke his tongue out a few times at his opponents. Spence Alton, very durable boxer. But he's getting caught there a few times. 
And if you haven't guessed it now, by now, my name's Eric Guy. Certainly Welsh boxing has taken off in the last few years with uh, Robbie Regan and Steve Robinson, to name just but two. This is Count Zaghi's third contest, the second in Wales. First one, as I said earlier on, was at Cardiff on the 3rd of October. Nice variation of shots. He's catching Alton with them left hooks. Oh, and down goes Alton. Spencer Alton acknowledges that was a good hook. But he's wise enough to stay down for a count of eight. But can Kaltaki finish his man off? Good double left. One to the body, one to the head. Good shots coming out from Kaltagi. Roddy Evans having a little bit of trouble pieing these two. So the end there, the first round. And well, we're going to the corner of Joe Kaltagi. See Terry Lawless on the outside of the ropes. Terry Lawless giving some expert advice. There's one man who's seen it all, oh, Terry Lawless. World champions, European champions, British champions. And now in the corner of his young protege, Joe Kautzaghi. Reminds me similarly to uh, another boxer, Southpaw, Gary Stretch. But certainly uh, he isn't just relying on the jab as Stretch used to. Can box well on the inside, Joe Kaltagi. Well, he's leaning in a bit with a the head there, Spencer Alton. Kaltagi's hands down by his waist. Good little left from Kautzaghi. Spence, <coughs> Spence Orton seems to have lost all defence. Looking nice and relaxed, Kautzaghi has a good left. Well, he's picking off Alton with that jab. Oh, some nice little combinations coming from Kautzaghi now. Well, the towel's come in from Spencer Walton. It's corner. But Roddy Evans has ignored it. Throwing the towel isn't acknowledged in this country. Amateur or pro. But Spencer Walton coming back.
Referee Roddy Evans, experienced ex-fighter. Well, Roddy Evans called it off. So the winner in two rounds, Joe Count Zaggy. Top of the bill here tonight in Newport. Wish we had a microphone to hear what was going on there. So, Joe Kelt taking go home tonight, a winner. And should be very pleased with his performance. And our commiserations go out, of course, to Spencer Alton.